Hey guys, it's me, Amy, from Vagabond Youth, and with summer around the corner, I decided to share with you what I would wear to a music festival or a concert. So this is my first look, and it's featuring this really beautiful bohemian-like top, and I recently picked it up from a online Korean boutique, and my favorite thing about it is the draping detail on it. It just flows so well and makes it great for dancing. And I swear by these shoes, these are the most comfortable boots I own. I almost wear them every day at school, even with all the hills and stuff. And these are my H&M low heeled booties. And I decided to pair it with a pair of mustard socks because you don't want no blisters. And for my shorts, you guys know my favorite high-waisted shorts that I hand distress and hand cut. I feel like music festivals often call for maxi skirts, so here I decided to pair it with my favorite floppy fedora that I got from H&M a while back. And hey, it might get cold, so throw on a cardigan. And this cardigan is also from an online Korean boutique, and I, it's actually the same one. And I really like it because it's kind of like a grandpa waffle knit cardigan, and if you guys know me, I don't really like form-fitting clothes. Well, not my outerwear at least. And this maxi skirt is actually from Plunder. And my favorite thing about it is that it has a slit so you can pop an Angelina Jolie anytime you want when it gets hot. And for my boots, I decided to go for an Isabel Marant inspired digger boot from C Madden. So this next look is definitely for my rocker babes and although all of these outfits can be worn to concerts, I definitely style this one to be specifically for a concert. I don't think I would wear this to a festival and that's just because I went for a long sleeve top and it's ribbed so it's very tight just in case it gets cold at night but you will be with a massive horde of people so I went for just some basic high waisted shorts and this is where it gets a bit controversial because I'm wearing these 4 inch combat styled lace up boots which I personally think are rad but they might hurt your feet when you are walking for 12 hours a day in the hot hot sun so I definitely would think this is for a good two hour amount of standing and I don't know I just like the way it looks Speaking of the hot, hot heat, if I were in a hotter climate, this outfit would definitely be an option. The focal point of this outfit is actually this bandage style bra with this really cute neon triangle in the middle that I recently got from H&M and it's actually a swimsuit top, but I wear it both as a bra and a swimsuit top. And for my shoes, I just decided to go for these cutout boots that I've been loving from Urban Outfitters. And for my skirt, I wore this really high-waisted kind of woven Aztec-like skirt. It's a little bit big on me, so I just kind of rolled it up. And I also paired it with a white leather moto jacket. All right, so we're down to my last look, and this look is actually one of my favorites out of all of the outfits I've styled in this video. And the reason being is just because I feel like this outfit is a lot more style and comfort-based than all the other ones. While the other ones are really comfortable too, I just feel like this is kind of sloppy and it just goes back to my roots. So here I'm donning a shirt from one of my favorite bands in the eighth grade, and that is Iron Maiden. And I'm also wearing something you guys haven't seen on me probably in a long time, and that is low waisted shorts and I got these surprisingly from American Eagle. They're ridiculously comfy. I did wear these to Coachella this year and they're just awesome. And for my jacket, I went for this white fabric moto jacket and it's just super lightweight. So that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you ever need to reach me, I have all of my links down below as well as the product descriptions. So yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Bye!